Welcome to Sip Talk. Today, let's talk about responsibly rehoming your cat. One of the biggest lessons that you learn in animal rescue is that life happens usually beyond our control, and sometimes it happens in a way that even the most responsible pet owners can no longer care for their pets. As a rescuer, it's not our place to judge other people or, or their situations. It's our place to help pets, and that's where this video and advice will be coming from. If you ever find yourself in a situation where you may need to rehome your cat, the first thing to do is to call or email your local shelters and rescues, but be prepared to hear and respect that they may be full and have a waiting list. If you have time and can wait, put yourself on one of those waiting lists. If you don't have time, see if a family member or a friend could foster until the waiting period is over. And if neither of those work out, the next step will be to rehome them yourselves. There are a lot of places online to post your pet. Your local animal shelter may participate in a nonprofit program called Home to Home, which will help you network your pet for placement and is totally free. There are Facebook groups dedicated to animal adoption or animal rescue who may be able to help you network. And there are sites too, other sites like Rehome by Adopt a Pet and PetRehomer.org, to name a few, um, where you can list your pet and start networking. I would not recommend rehoming your pet without a fee. I would also never recommend dumping your animal, either by roadside or at a shelter. Shelters are working at maximum capacity already, and forcing them to take your pet is both irresponsible and cruel. I hope this helped. Please remember to have empathy not only for cats and dogs, but for your fellow humans as well. If you have any more questions, please feel free to ask in the comments, and we'll do our best to help you out.